Hello again, my name is Gabe Zona. This is the 6th of February 2018. Anyone uh, want to wager as to whether or not the government gets shut down on the 8th? Hmm? Well, I saw that worthless majority leader of the Senate, you know, Mitch McConnell. Mitch doesn't think the government's going to shut down. Well, <laughs> let's take a look at the pieces of the puzzle. You got the Democrats livid with the release of that FISA memo. You got Adam Schiff with his rebuttal to that FISA memo, which he says was unrealistic, which he said painted the Democrats in a bad light. No, the Democrats painted themselves in a bad light. Our government is totally dysfunctional. You've got people in the government, the majority of which don't live in a real world. You got people like Maxine Waters who lives in a five million dollar house and her constituents live on the edge of poverty. <laughs> you got Nancy Pelosi who talks about rich white people when she's the fourth wealthiest person in Congress. <laughs> Does any of this make any sense to you? huh? These politicians for the most part are absolutely worthless. Personally, I think it's too late. I don't think you can fix our government. What has to happen is you've pretty much got to start all over with selecting people that are truly enamored with our country, want to protect our country, and don't have the aspirations that many of these do when they come into our Senate or in our Congress, which is to become multimillionaires, which most of them do. The senator from Arizona, not the one with brain cancer, the other one, Jeffrey DeFlake Flake, he's going to retire. He's not going to run again because he probably knows he would have lost. But what's he going to do? Is he going to go on the circuit? Hmm? Or is he going to become a lobbyist? Or is he just going to live off of his zombie accounts? <laughs> huh? I don't know. Folks, the government doesn't work. You got long-term politicians that don't live in a real world. The Attorney General, Jeff Session, what's he done? Huh? He was a senator in Alabama, which is where he should have stayed as a senator in Alabama. I don't know what got into Trump's head picking that guy to make him attorney general. He's totally worthless. But it's not just the attorney general. We know that the CIA created Google and I believe Facebook, probably 23andMe. Why? Data mining. They're mining us. They're getting ready to do what they want to us. Folks, you really need to wake up. I'm willing to bet that the government will get shut down in two days because we have a worthless, dysfunctional government. They don't care if the military doesn't get paid. They don't care because they still get paid. I don't know for certain, but I'm pretty certain it'll get shut down. And that worthless representative from the Democrats, well, they're all worthless. Chucky Schumer, with his glasses hanging off of his nose, and Nancy Pelosi. What's wrong with the American people to allow that kind of insanity to continue? This woman is clearly out of her mind, as is Maxine Waters. Impeach! 45! Impeach! 45! 
What's wrong with our government that allows someone that has brain cancer allowed to vote in the Senate? He's got brain cancer. We saw that he can't think clearly when he was questioning the previous FBI director, James Comey. He went into Disneyland. Go Google it. He went into Disneyland. And this guy is still allowed to make monumental decisions and vote on monumental bills? What more evidence do you need to know how screwed up this country is? The system doesn't work. We need to start over. We need term limits. Two terms in the Senate and two terms in the Congress. And you can't jump from one to the other, which is what they all do. Jeffrey the Flake Flake was a congressman for 10 years and a one-term senator. That's 16 years he's lived off of you. You don't think he's got a nest egg stashed? Absolutely, completely, and totally insane. As I said, we'll know in two days if I'm right or if I'm wrong. I think the government's going to get shut down. And Mitch McCall is clueless. That's what I think. We'll see, won't we?